Alright, here, welcome back. Guess the number 51. War on the Pacific, War on the Sea. Here we are, day 2, tree 6. 20th October 1942. 45 command dollar dues in the bank. Man, it's been a couple weeks here. So, sorry to keep you guys hanging, but work, family, all the things. Time for beer <laughs> and war. <laughs> Let's get to it. Mmm. Oh, yummy, yummy. Mm, no. <laughs> anyway, what do we got going on? So let's figure this out. Um, it has been a minute. Uh, so we are fighting. We're trying to hunt down planes. Uh, well, hunt down ships over here in the uh, Philippine Sea. Herring is here with Tarpedas. Drum had a couple good shots last time. We'll keep her in the area. Haddock. Haddock. Hello. Hello, Haddock. There you are. 17 torpedoes. Cool. Um, meanwhile, we have Enterprise, Saratoga, and Hornets in the area. Let's go find some Japanese carriers today, shall we? So, down here in Rabal, we have this kind of sorted out, don't we? Yeah. They need supplies, and we were looking to actually take Kev Yang up here, but we almost got bushwhacked. That might have been two episodes ago over here. Oh, no, that was a live stream. We almost got bushwhacked out here, so we took care of that. We kicked him on the way back out, so let's keep these guys around here. Task Force A is down here and desperately needs reinforcements. Um... Ooh, yeah, uh, uh, not too bad, not too bad. Ooh, uh, 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 uh. a little bit of damage there. Hmm. So, but let's bring it back in here. What do we have here in Saipan? We're up to a three. These guys are coming in hot and heavy with supplies and troops and all the things. Actually, probably just supplies. These guys here are heading out. These guys are heading over to Wake. Uh, two Cimarrons and one, two, three, four transports. Yeah, let's soak everything out of here that we can. Fuel, 311, so 140 a piece, that's 280. Yeah, let's go ahead and Let's get everything out of wake that we can. Uh, meanwhile, what else do we have? Milne, you guys are heading back. Need to resupply these guys. No damage here, so perfect. And then Force A. A little bit of damage, not too bad. Let's get them back and also figure out what we're going to do next. Oh, sorry. Hang on. Let me organize my stuff here. Here we go. So, primary objective is to find stuff out here today. These guys are covered by cap. Yeah. So these guys got cats up here. Out of Saipan. Let's go ahead and do this here real quick. Shoot some fools down. Oh, we got a nice line here. What do we got coming in? We've got zeros with no bum, no boombas, no boombas. So let's go ahead and shoot all these guys down. Yeah, I need to reorganize these guys a little bit here. They're all spread out in a line. That's okay. Let's go shoot some fools down here. Well, cat's coming in hot and heavy. We got nine. Perfect. Go get them, boys. These guys are going to come in hot, straight, normal. We'll get at least one good pass on them. Actually, having all these guys spread out like this is not a bad idea. They're going to do a strafe attack. Here come all the boys. Coming in. Coming in hot. Who are we going to shoot down? Of course, they're going to have to spin back around. Whoop! Whiff. Whiff. Yeah. Yeah. It's okay. These guys are going to level off, so we got one. What do we got? We got four? 
Okay, it's about to have a bad day. That's two down. Splash. Here come these guys. Navy shooting at you. All the Navy shooting at you. Well, these guys are probably Marines. Splash, splash. One more over here. You get the idea yet, brother? I think he's getting the idea that this is a bad idea. This guy over here, no. He wants to come in and complete mission, sir. Let's see if we get this dude. Should be able to get him. Yeah, got him. So one left. This guy over here fighting for his life. <laughs> I'm sorry, man. When it's nine on one, it's a bad day. So he is definitely not interested in strafing anymore. He's more interested in survival. So <laughs> let's see if he makes it. He's not gonna make it. <laughs> Good cold Colorado Coors. A whole bunch of pain coming your way, dude. Well, yeah, he's going to try and abort here. Being a sneaky punk, man. Let's see if this dude gets a shot. A little oblique shot. Nah, he can turn way too fast. Maybe. Come on, bro. Come on, bro. You can get a burst off. Let's see. Got a bunch of other guys looking for him. He's too fast for us, though. Let's see. Let's see what he decides to do. Whiff. He's clever. We'll give him that. Does clever matter? We'll find out here in a sec. Yeah, he's a little bit fast for us. So all we have here is Wildcats. Should we give it to him? Yeah, he's outpacing us. Let's see if the Navy punches a hole in him. It might. Let's destroy it right there. Maybe. Nah, I think he's gonna call it good. Yeah, he's dusting us here, so. Let's give the Navy one more shot at him. Spank, spank, no. No, all right. I guess you get to live, dude. So six up, five down. Call it good. Let's get these guys in here. I'm going to send more dudes out here. I'm going to totally miss us. Let's go ahead and offload everything. Bang. Dunzo. So Saipan. 51 fuel. Yeah, we got to get that other fuel convoy back. These guys here. Go ahead and roll these guys back on up to midway. Off you guys go. Meanwhile, up in here, let's find something. I'm not worried about that. Might be worried about that. We'll see. You're going to catch us on the way back? They are going to catch us on the way back. Let's go ahead and uh, rearrange these guys. Battle line is usually my favorite. So six and five, six and five up front, seven over here on the side. Yeah, that'll work. Well, let's go ahead and open up the spread. Here we go. Perfect. What do we got here? It looks like Val's. Jill's. You guys got bombs on you? You do. Let's go shoot some of these guys down. So they're gonna be a little bit high. See if my boys can climb up and get them here. And again, all these guys are empties, so not too worried about it. Let's see if we can go ahead and splash some of these land-based planes here. Yeah, they're going to try and match altitude. Looks like the Navy's 
spotting them here a little bit. There they are. They're out here. They're right up there. We're gaining altitude. In we go. These guys do have stingers on them, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, they do. <laughs> but slow. So they're going to get them when they start their bomb run. If they don't get them on this first pass here. Come on, boys. Get a couple of them. Nope. Now yeah, they're going to go up another, another couple hundred feet here, man. I might shoot down a couple of them, boys. Get a couple of them, though, in the meantime. So, Jill's are a little bit later war plane. A little bit more hardy in terms of their construction, but as soon as they level out, try and get out of here. Yeah, we'll splash a few of them. There goes one. So that's one down. Let's see if we can get a couple more here. here. Come all the boys. Of course, they got those stingers on them. We'll see. Nope, didn't help that dude. It's one, two kills for that dude. Come on, man. Get him. Three kills. Yeah. Yeah, buddy. One left. Out here. He's done, so. That's That would be all customers serviced properly. So six up, six down. Lost none. Perfect. Um... Jill should be land-based planes or later war carrier planes. We'll see. There still might be a carrier out here somewhere, but you gotta keep watching for this and see like this little guy here. Three ships? I bet you it's just one. Let's go check it out, just in case. There we go. Yeah, it's just one little dude out here. Yeah, no, we don't care about you, man. It's cool. Go ahead and tootle on along. Counter side pan up here. Yeah, those guys are coming out of Guam on the way back. And see, we could we could jump them on the way back, but nah, screw that. It's fine. It's fine. Eventually, we go down here and scrape down Guam. We just have to reload our battle wagons. So you guys need to go all the way back up to Midway. Actually, you know what? Tinian's a three. Hang on. We got some damage here. Colorado. One prop. Mississippi. Two on the bulges. Ten damage. Yeah, let's go ahead and run them back. Yeah. We got time. We got time. We'll take time. It's fine. Don't care what you guys are doing. $61 it is. $106. Nice. Do we need to beef up Force A? That guy is wrecked. Twelve damage on War Spite. I'm kind of curious. Let's jump in here and check these guys out. All I'm doing here is checking out the damage. It's fine, 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 fine. Got some dingers. That's a dingers, but fine. All right, so we're not losing any speed or anything here. All these guys are at 100%. Let's get out. Eventually, we do have to replace these guys down here. Hang on just a sec. Lork and York and Lex. Five damage, three flooded. 
Zero floated. Oh man, I'm kind of tempted to keep these guys down here too. Let's jump in here and just check out. Make sure that nothing's blocked out. These guys. Alright, so York does have a little bit of reduction in speed. Not too bad. Lex is fine. Lena is pristine. Kazan's good. Leaves is good. Brooklyn's good. Okay. You know what? We probably don't have to rotate these guys back. I mean, we can pull them back into uh, Milne here, which is at a three to replenish all the planes. So let's go ahead and do that. And then what I'm thinking here. Um, ooh. We could beef this up with another war spite. And maybe two more destroyers for another war spite a hobart and two destroyers yeah let's do that um not historical here so but let's keep it all in uh under the same flag shall we who are we gonna get qe War Spice in there. Let's, uh, who doesn't get much love? Let's do Malaya, shall we? I don't think she was in the, she was in the Indian Ocean at this time, but yeah, sure. Let's go ahead and grab one of her. Let's grab another Perth. So we have Hobart. Uh, let's grab Perth. Bang, so that's $79 dues. Let's grab two more destroyers. And these need to be, uh, Jervis's. Oh, let's get a Dutch one. What the hell? Let's do that. Let's grab Nepal. So this is Bort's B. So we'll say these guys were like uh, short up over on the west coast or down in Canberra. Whatever. And they're ready, Freddy. Let's go ahead and merge those guys up. That leaves us with nine command dollar reduce. So we got another week before we actually have to organize our transports here a little bit. We're going to release a couple of these guys too. So, but that will give us a pretty good Oz uh, presence down here. What do we got up here? What are you? Close to task force two. Let's drop a pin here and let's see what this is. Yeah, we can go bang on some cruisers here. That'd be great. Let's go check this out. It's early in the morning too. 7 o'clock in the morning. Perfect. Where are you, boss? Oh, Lord. Come in here. You're going to fight me? Yeah, go ahead and fight me. Go ahead and do the spinny spin. Where are you? What do we got up here? Not a cruiser. This is a carrier. Bam, baby. Let's go sink this fool. Uh, what are you? Um, had a little bit of trouble IDing these guys in the past. So let's get you. Uh, you're a CV. So tower is on the port side. No, so do you. Yeah, no. You guys pointed that out last time with the deck. This is uh, Unryu, correct? Yeah, gotta be. One, two, three, four. keep trying to ID these guys by the elevators but that's not working this guy doesn't have the meatball up here not a Ruiho nope nope those guys are both dead that guy's dead so do you we did bang her up pretty bad so it's not her it's got to be it's got to be this guy where are we going? Speed 30 hitting 346 heading due north. Well, a little bit north, north uh, northwest. What else is in here? Uh, 
light cruiser. Very little in the aircraft in here. So we got one, two, three, four modern destroyers. Yeah. And one light cruiser. I don't think this guy's got DP guns on him. All right, let's go ahead and call that good. Speed 30, heading 346. Let's get out of here and go ahead and hit this guy. All right, so um, let's uh, remove this. Uh, you are not that. You are that. So heading 30, 346. 346, heading this way. 30 knots. Let's go ahead and launch the attack. Um, oh no, not cargo. Aircrafts. Let's do aircraft. Daunts. 1,000 pound bombs, 544. Um, hang on just a sec. So 346. That's one hour. That's two hours. Let's drop a pin right there. That's two hours. We're gonna have to launch cap with these guys too. Um, so we got three carriers. Let's do all the things. Let's use Enterprise here to actually like scope this out. So that's one and a half hours. That's two hours. Should be right about there. In theory. Okay, boys, Sister Sarah, go ahead and launch up uh, cats. Cool. Stick with those dots. Cool. And then Sister Sarah, let's go ahead and barf up another batch of dots. I think 48 is is pretty good. Yeah. Keep Hornet as a follow-up. Which unfortunately is the role that she usually assumes. <laughs> here we go. Should be up in here. Ah, there they are, baby. Found ya. Found you, fool. Are you guys going to have to head back? No, you got 22 nautical miles left on these guys. Get up in there. You guys get up in there. And you guys get up in there. So we're going to wait until these guys turn back. Oh, no. We're already in. All right. So we're in. In we go. Here we go. Let's go bag ourselves a carrier, shall we? Where are you, fool? Should be up this way. They're there. They're right there. Perfect. All right, Wildcats. I'm just gonna leave those on. Uh, on uh, go attack the things. So, put those guys on. Uh, dogfight at will. There we go. Everybody else. Uh, box up, warm up, and head up. I'm trying to do this proper like this time. So there we go. Up. Nav this way. And then everybody else. Same thing. Form up, box up. 7,000 feet. Max speed. Let's go out this way. Should get everybody boxed up. Well, cats are way back here. We might catch some cap. We'll see. So, but these are definitely our victims. Let's go ID. Unryu. Here. Oh, yeah. We got this guy. We got him. Got him, baby. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to split these guys up into smaller groups. Um, 24... 48, so 24 in each section. Let's do four groups of six for each section. 
Go bomb the Jesus out of this dude. Everybody up. Almost up to alt. Oh yeah, this will be nice. Nice and juicy. So 6400, let's get this up to 7,000 feet. Go ahead and turn in. Got some trouble here. Here we go. So let's do uh, four groups of six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Throw them up. One, two, three, four, five, six. Throw them up. One, two, three, four, five, six. Form up. One, two, three, four, five, six. Form up. Let's let those guys spread around a little bit. These guys are up to 7,000 feet, so let's do the same thing. Two, three, four, five, six. Form up. Uh, you. Three, four, five, six. Form up. One, two, three, four, five, six. Form up. Finally, one, two, three. Six. Form up in box. Nice tight boxes. Nice tight boxes. And here we go. In we go. Target this guy. Attack. Attack. Absolutely brutal here, man. So we're gonna go ahead and wreck this dude. Everybody's coming at the same time. Where are my wildcats? Let's uh, go ahead and have on around, just in case anything shows up. Keep an eye on things. Uh, let's go ahead and split the distance here in terms of uh, altitude. Yeah, so we're all nice and broken up here. A little bit tight, but not too bad. It is looking good. Come on in, boys. Oh, the murder. Murder's gonna hurt. Look at this, this is beautiful. There they are. <laughs> Gonna die. Oh man, this is one of four carriers I believe that they have left. And so we're about to wreck this thing. Let's go ahead and hang in the straps here. There they go, you're gonna shoot at us, that's a bad idea. Well, that's a good idea, but it ain't gonna work. It ain't gonna work. It ain't gonna work. Here we come. Gonna drop on down. Oh, it's gonna hurt. You guys wanna watch it from the straps. Hanging in the straps. Here we go, boys. Splash one of my boys. Splash two of my boys. Here come the bombs. It's gonna hurt. flight coming in. She's done though. Done. That was fast. That was fast. We got all these other boys coming in here. Should we redirect? Probably should. Probably should. Redirect. Attack that guy. Attack that guy. Go back some destroyers too, boys. I know. I'm sorry. 
That's all we got left, though. Adjustments on the fly here. I'm actually gonna get that guy. There we go. Let's see if we can get back a couple other things here since that carrier's already cooked. Let's see what happens. I mean, they all have uh, SAP bombs, so I get something. You never know. There you go, going after this dude. Whiff, yeah. I know boys, not quite as easy to hit. What about this dude over here? Miss that guy. What about this guy? Let's see if we get him. Nah. <laughs> that was a good thought. So I lost two though. Plus three. Good box formation there, man. Everybody's getting out of here. We did get a hit on this dude. Did get a hit on him. Let's check that out. Uh, where's my report? Uh, sunk moderate, moderate, minor. And then where's the where's the light cruiser? Minor, minor. Yeah, probably not. But we got what we came for. We got what we came for. Dunzo. One more Japanese heavy carrier down. So. Yeah, the Unrias were built uh, ground up as carriers, if I'm not mistaken. So that's okay. They'll make a nice addition to the. Uh, IJN Naval Preserve there on the bottom of the Philippine Sea. Oh, oh, you gonna duck up again? And Dunzo. Man, like four minutes. Four minutes. Imagine trying to get off a carrier in four minutes with 2,000 other guys trying to get around. Something just blew up. I don't know what it was. It was probably her. So, Dunzo. Sinky, sinky. Dog on. Ah, how many of those guys timed out as opposed to how many of them we lost? I don't know. Let's find out. Looks like that one was downed. Let's get out of here. Let's see. 11 aircraft? Okay, we'll take it. For a carrier? Not bad. Not bad. Let's go ahead and scrub all these things off here. You guys are in good position. Let's go ahead and RTB. Nicely done. And of course, this is a three. So we can just scooch these guys back over here and pick up new planes. <laughs> a little bit unfair. Don't care about this guy. Screw that. All right. So that's, uh, let's check our, uh, let's check our carrier report here. Shall we? So that was a Magi, and so Unryu is still out there, as is Tayo is sunk. Junyo, so that's two. Shoei and Zui are both done. Hiryu is done. Soryu is out there, but we put some pretty good dingers on her. The only other one, the big one that's left is Akagi, and she's out here somewhere. So let's go ahead and reposition these guys. Let's uh, head on up this way and see if she decides to make an appearance. So, because literally, that's like the only thing that they have left is two Junio and Akagi, and then they do have one battleship left. And that would be uh, Hizen right there, because we got Sagami. Cool. All right, so that's the plan. Anyway, we bagged the carrier. Bang. We'll take it. So, 
We got pretty good coverage out here. 1520. We might have to launch up some more search planes out this way in the morning. Let's see. Encounter at Mill. You guys are not sending stuff down here towards me. Are you? Are you really? KSS though. 1531. How are we doing on ammo? 640? 800? 800? We're good on ammo. Let's get these guys up in here. I don't know what this is. Up in here. 1531. We have enough time to launch a search plane up there. Do we have a Sunderland? We do have a Sunderland. Let's go ahead and kick a guy up here. Let's see what's going on here, man. 1531. We got about two hours. Launch an airstrike up there, too. Let's just see what this is. 2CA, 3CL coming in at night. Yeah, let's go check this out. We might want to hit them with uh, both fighters. Oh, I didn't mean to send up three of these guys. What we got here? This is a convoy. This has got to be a convoy. It is not a convoy. It is a bombard group. With two heavy cruisers. So what do we got here? This is Miyoko, right? Man, these guys just not gonna give it up. Not gonna give it up. Nope, not Pluritaka. Mogami. So there we go. One Mogami. We got three of those left. What are you over here? You're another Mogami. Mm. Mm. I don't want to fight these guys. With uh, the Australians. Because they got what? Two heavy cruisers. Are you a Kitakami? No. And we got what? One, two light cruisers. One, two, three, four, five, six modern destroyers. Two heavy cruisers, two light cruisers. Yeah, ugh, this is a little bit ugly. Let's get out of here. What are we at? 1630? We could probably hit them. Oh, these guys are too far away. These guys are way too far away. So anyway, that guy's here. I know where they're going. They're going down towards Milne. Um, we gotta put up the boys. Before it's a torpedoes. Let's go use some uh, fine British torpedoes on these guys. And we'll get these guys in position here. We might get bombarded here, and we'll see. That's a lot of iron coming our way. Let's see if we can grab this guy. Should be right about here. Should be right about here. Or not. Torpedoes, right? Yeah. Where are you, boys? <laughs> Where are these guys? <laughs> I'll be down here. Or not. 
Probably doing about 30 knots. We might be a little bit further southwest here. All right, you guys. Well, we get a lot of gas. So let's, uh, let's chase you down, shall we? Let's see if this guy shows up. There they are. Eh, hey. <laughs> yeah, a little bit further than I thought. Let's go ahead and chase him down. Here we go, tactical. Where are you? Oh, they're over here. Okay, that's not bad. So we got nine, three groups of three. Do that. Oh. Let's go this way here. Hit the, hit the deck, boys. Um, yeah, unfortunately, like every time I use these guys, I lose a bunch of them. So, but let's knock out a heavy cruiser. And I think our Australian boys could probably handle the rest. I mean, we're going to catch a whole truck ton of torpedoes. Let's split these guys up and let's go after. Um, who are we gonna go after here? We gotta go after this guy. Yeah, we gotta come in this way and go after him. Yeah, we're gonna take some losses here, man. It's just gonna suck. But let's do it. Um, and we'll break these guys up into three flights of three, three sections of three. And we're gonna go after this dude here. Uh, what are you? Yoko. Mogami. Yeah, let's get one of you, at least. <laughs> it's a lot of destroyers, man. So, but if I knock out one of the heavy cruisers, then they won't have that much firepower to actually knock out Milne. So, let's make sure we bag at least one of these guys. Or at least get them to turn away and go home. So, until I get the other battleship down here. Hmm. Not ideal. But doable. So, alright, go forwards. Let's go up this way. Let's go ahead and speed on up. Come in this way. Pretty, pretty open angle. Uh, these guys do not have DP guns. These guys do. So yeah, I think this guy is the safest guy to attack. Even though we're gonna cheese it out that way over the. And these guys both have DP guns. Yeah, we're gonna lose some boys here, man. It's just, there's no way around it. Kind of tempted to keep them all bunched up together. Let's, uh... Let's do this. Do a nice big fat box here. Like that. I mean, I could break them into three separate sections. That might not be a bad idea either. So let's do that. First attack. You guys next. You guys last. So we got them all spread out here pretty good. Remember, we only got one torpedo for each plane. So 300 yards apart. It's going to be pretty spread out, but. Um, actually, what I probably should do is just like set these guys to attack individually. Not in formation. It's okay. Coming in. 
let's do it that way. Attack. Let's try it this way. Yeah, let's do it this way. We'll see. <laughs> we'll see. They're all at max throttle, so... Let's see what happens here. Should drop right behind this guy here. It's gonna be ugly, though. I already lost one. Ah, they're, they're bunched up way too close. Oh, maybe not. They're kind of spread out. There we go. There's a torpedo in the water. That guy got splashed. That torpedo. These guys are all dropped torpedoes. Let's see. Here they come. It might hurt. Ooh. Ooh, it might hurt. Oh, man. Look at how many boys we lost, though, man. It's brutal. This is gonna hurt, though. It's gonna hurt this dude. Yeah. Oh, that one missed. Lean. There we go. 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 Oh man. Yeah. This guy's. Ha this guy had a bad day. I mean, we had a bad day, but this guy had a bad day too. So we'll take that. He had a real bad day. Real bad day. Let's check our report here. Heavy critical. Yeah, that's a real bad day. Oh, that, that, that this dude took one too. Yeah. <laughs> we'll take that. Go bonk into her, please. Little hot Japanese on Japanese action is never unwelcome around here. <laughs> Not going to work out that way, though. This guy's got problems, though. Ooh, we got problems. We got problems. Stability problems. Let's see how this works out. Got some problems. Man, unfortunately, we lost a bunch of those boys. So, that's how it works with the Australian planes, though, man. They're just a little bit too slow, and you don't have enough of them to actually, like, spread things out a little bit. So, but, they put some hits on this dude. Dead in the water. Got any spin on the screws? We are dead in the water. Check that out. Come here and give us a little hug. Nah. No, nope, not this time. This guy's smoking on the inside. No deck fires. Might live, but is definitely going to have to go back home. If they decide to come down and fight War Spike, this guy will be an absolute anchor the rest of them. This guy's not doing too hot either. Are you just going to stop there, man? You going to stop? You guys going to give each other a little hug here? That'd be great. No? 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 Let me police up my boys here. Let you guys just uh, hang out in the area, please. Let's go see what happens here. This Mogami. Uh, she got her fire out, so she's fine. She's gonna live, unfortunately. That guy got her fire out, so everybody here is good. Let's just see what these guys decide to do. They might go back home, they might come down and fight us. You never know. Uh, 
Um, if they decide to come down and fight us, Force A is in the area. So that's where we will keep them. Anyway, off we go. Let's see what they decide to do. Give me five wide Catalina. No, up here. Yeah, I don't care about this. Piss off. Leave me alone. Ooh, pretty night. Bye. <laughs> Not my problem. Uh, you guys are coming down. You guys are coming in. You guys are coming in. You guys are where I want you to be. Let's get you up to wake up in here. Because uh, we need to load up them tankers. Send them back down here to stop paying. Elm Bay ready to launch. Let's see, what are they doing? Looks like, yeah, see, it's, check that out. They're, they're going to cheese it out of here. So, sorry boys, no surface fight tonight. Um, maybe next time. But next time, we'll have more... We'll have more iron in the area. So they're going to come back. Uh, I guarantee they're going to send Heezen down here at some point in time. So let's just keep him there. So same thing with you boys over here. How are we doing on planes? Uh, a little bit low on planes. So let's go ahead and duck you guys into the harbor here. We fell down planes. And we got to keep the carriers out here somewhere just in case they decide to do some bullshit stuff like they did the other day with uh, Guadalcanal. Enemy troops defeated at Rabal. Rabal is ours. Yeah, buddy. Uh, you guys definitely need some supplies, though. Before we go leapfrog up to here, then we'll probably do that here pretty soon. So, but we need to get some of these guys back. Like you guys in particular. We need to beef this up here a little bit with a couple more C3s. So, let's do that. Still watching for a Kagi out here. There you are, man. Let's drop a pin on you. There you are. This has got to be a Kagi. Herring, you going to get the shot off? Let's go see. Let's go see. Where are you, man? Where are they? Oh, out here. Yeah, perfect. What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? The big girl. We are not in terrible firing position either. So this is uh, Kagi. Do you? Let's go ahead and shoot all the torpedoes, shall we? Kagi. Speed 28 mm. heading 009. Let's go ahead and set this up. What do we got up front? We got 14. We'll use six of those and a one degree spread. Mm. 75, 78, 33. It's a great solution. Here we go. Mm. So let's see. This is uh, heading 009. 5,000 yards. Ooh, she's pretty far off. She's pretty far off. Let's go ahead and speed up. Let's go ahead and speed up. This might be a hip shot. It's going to be a hip shot. So the range is pretty far. pretty far. Uh, we might actually want to take this down to a zero here. It's not a terrible solution though. Yeah. We're just going to wait this until this gets down to a zero. 5,000 yards. Ah, that's max range on these torpedoes. And of course Bjord might absolutely jack us here. But here we go. Shoot the things. All six. Off we go. Dive the boat. Let's cheese it out of here. Come on, Herring. Oh, wait. Let me get my Silver Sides hat on. <laughs> <laughs> for good luck <laughs> for good luck 
because we're going to need it. We're definitely going to need it. Let's GTFO, man. Such a good model. Love these models, man, in this game. So, let's see, where are we at? Oh, we're not even at an hour yet, man. Might be able to pick her up on the flip side with the carriers. Let's see if Herring gets the kill, though. Never a bad day for a sub kill. Especially on a big old girthy girl like this. Hey, sister. Last surviving member of Keto Butai. Well, I actually, no, that's uh, Soryu. Uh, who is definitely heading back towards Japan with a whole bunch of holes in her thanks to USS Drum. Let's see if we can grab a Kagi here, though. There's torpedoes way out here. Oh, no, maybe not. Maybe that's them out there. I can't quite tell. Let's see. Let's go ahead and speed this up and see what happens here. Should be able to see him. There they are. They're right there. They're right there. Oh, they're really nice and tight. That's too bad. I should have put a one degree spread on them. Look at that. They're way too tight. But, if they all hit, that'd be good too. So, here we go. Should have put a one degree spread on them. It was a little bit closer than I thought. Got a little gun shy there. Looking hot. Looking pretty hot. Here we go. She's turning. She sees him. We see you. Dunk. One. Oh, God dang it, really? <laughs> that was five thunks, man. Brutal. Absolutely brutal. Thanks, Bjord. <laughs> All right, sorry, Herring. You got jacked by the, uh, jacked by the Navy. We only got one hit on her. Let's check out the report here. Minor. Okay. That's okay. We know where you are. What's our, our our heading? Our heading is all jacked up now, but she was heading almost due north, speed 23. Let's see if uh, the fly boys can pick her up now. So, because that was out here. Dang, that's close. Yeah, let's go ahead and launch. Uh, Hornet, you get to lead this one. So she was heading north. Let's go ahead and grab this dude. So it's heading to three. So this way, correct? She was heading north. Should be able to get pretty close. Let's try that. All right, that was Hornet. Let's uh, throw up Sister Sarah with uh, your cats done. Go ahead and escort those Dauntlesses. And then Enterprise boys, you guys got enough, uh, got enough paint on the deck house there, so let's go ahead and uh, throw up a few more from Sister Sarah here. Here we go. Uh, stick with the other guys, Daunts. All right, let's see if we can grab this fool. Should be up in here. That's probably them right there. That's probably them. Let's go check it out. All right, fool. What do we got? <laughs> yeah, man. All right, so we got two groups of dots. They're a little bit offset here. Let's go ahead and bring them all back together. So, these guys up here. 
1 through 24. Let's go ahead and uh, box up form up. Altitude, max speed. Let's go back this way. And then the rest of my daunts here. Form up, box up. 7,000 feet, max speed. Head this way. And then all my cats. Form up. Let's, uh, let's do something like this, just in case any cap shows up. Here we go. Off you go, boys. We're professionals now. We know what we're doing. So sorry, Silver Sides. You're not going to get the kill tonight. I'm going to put on my carrier cap, USS Bennington. And let's go carry the hell out of this dude. You guys doing what I told you to do? Looks like they're doing what I told them to do. So that's all these guys form up. And this is all these guys form up. There we go. So we got blue leader, we got gold leader, and we got rogue leader. Here, rogue leader. You guys, uh. Let's, uh. Spool up there. They're all on, uh, auto dogfight. So. Uh, if anything shows up here, we're gonna murder it. So, but this is the main prize. Oh my gosh, look how much look how many planes out here. It's just bananas. B-A-N-A-N-A-S. So let's go ahead and ID this guy. This is of course the flagship of the Japanese fleet. IJN Akagi. So 36,000 tons of soon to be added tonnage to the IJN Naval Maritime Preserve. <laughs> oh man. Got them both in one night. That's that's crazy. Right, boys, let's go out this way. Uh, gold leader. Jeb. Uh, herbal leader. Or blue leader. Let's go out this way. Actually, you know what? Screw this. Attack. We need to attack these guys before they cheese it out of here. So, here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six. Form up and attack. One, two, three, four, five, six. Form up. Oh, come on. What are you guys doing? One, two, three, four, five, six. Come on. One, two, three, four, five, six. Form up. One, two, three, four, five, six. Form up. One, two, three, four, five, six. Form up. Here we go. Target that guy. Attack. Attack. He's trying to slip out of here, man. We're not going to let him do that. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six. Form up. One, two, three, four, five, six. Form up. One, two, three, four, five, six. Form up. Last but not least, one, two, three, four, five, six. Four, five. There we go. Let's get everybody on Akagi here before they slip out of here. Because that's exactly what we're trying to do because the map is getting a little bit too big here. And all my Wildcats, I want all you guys up here. There we go. Do not let these guys out of our sight. Alright, so all these guys will split up here a little bit. Uh, the Wildcats. Let's do something like this. And they are all on auto attack. Or auto dogfight. In case something comes our way. But I am not letting this guy out of my sight again. Which happened 
what was that, like two videos ago? So, there we go. Now we're reestablishing contact. They, it looks like they don't have any cap up. I mean, there might be some dudes out here somewhere. So, yep, there are. And all my wildcats just got lit up here. So they're going to go fight all these dudes. So, yep. So they got nine zeros up. We're going to let them go fight all those boys. So all my wildcats have a job to do now. They're going to go jump those dudes. I'm not going to break these guys out of formation. So if they want to come fight us in formation, they can come fight us in formation. So... Kagi's going to spin around here like a, a drunken fool, trying to get out of this mess that she's gotten herself into. But, hey man, we see you, we got you, we're coming for you. Yeah, you can go ahead and spin on into us too, that's fine. So we got you though. This one little dude out here wants to come fight my entire formation of Donlesses. We got a whole bunch of stingers out here. A whole bunch of fighty, angry tail gunners who would love to bag themselves a zero. We're going to let them do it. So do not break formation, boys. His problem, not yours. Uh, well, that's it, kind of our problem, but whatever. So. Lost a wildcat, splashing some zeros down here. Still going after the prize up here though, man. We're gonna let this fur ball play out the way that it is down here. Don't have that much cap, bro. This guy up here is gonna come in here and try and fight our entire dauntless formation. Look at these guys. They're like, nope, 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 nope. <laughs> <laughs> you stick your finger in this hornet's nest, man, you're gonna get bit. <laughs> so, yeah, you're gonna get bit, but good. Yeah, die. So, and here are the ships over there. I'm gonna go ahead and grab one of these guys here so you can see what's going on. So, looks like Kagi's trying to run for her life. It's not gonna matter. We are splashing zeros left and right down here with the Wildcats. So, good job on the escort. But again, you guys are going to get shot at by the Navy, which is fine. We have the carrier, the carrier separated out from the rest of the group here. It's a bad task force control there, man. It's, it's going to be a bad day. Well, a great day for us. Bad day for us. So, lost, uh, what, two Wildcats and the Donalus. We're gonna lose a couple more thanks to Flack, but Wildcats are down here having fun. Just let them do it. One boy here has got the idea, man. Oh yeah, we're lined up on her, but good. Lined up on a Kagi, but good. Here we go, coming in soon, coming in hot, along with all your brothers. Just kind of have to like sit here and watch this. All these guys are going to pitch over about within the same like, two or three seconds. Check that out. Check that out. All the, They're all coming in, man. <laughs> you got to love it. You got to love it. Here we go, boys. This guy's gonna get the first shot. Bombs away. Hit. Hit. Hits. And hits. And hits. And hits. And hits. And crazy hits. And more hits. And we gotta take the screenshot now, man. <laughs> Absolutely cooked. Sunk. There's a whole another batch of Dauntless. Oh no, that was everybody. That was everybody. Everybody came in at the same time. 
and just absolutely plastered IJN Akagi. Dunzo. Check that out. Check that big girthy girl out. She is she is ours. So tracked her down and now she's done. We'll take it. Uh, where are my my wildcats? Let's go ahead and place you guys up here. Gentlemen, form up. I think you got all the things, man. Shit down all the things. Anything down here? Yeah, you got them all. Oh, it's not going to let me do it. No, no, here we go. Now we got it. We can sit here and give Akagi her due. So, flagship of the Japanese uh, Kita Butai. Probably got Naguma her, himself. We're trying to find a, a place on the boat. From my understanding, the Emperor's portrait on this ship was particularly large. So. <laughs> Might require a little bit more space than the boats, but man, the ship had like what 2,500 guys on it, man. And we just wrecked it in uh, about five minutes. So that's a lot of boys who are going to need to find a new home here pretty quick. Um, which is brutal. Which is brutal. Look at that. She's going down fast. Absolutely down fast. Sinking like straight down full down flight deck just swallowed by the sea can't imagine being on a ship like that check that out Dunzo not even a couple minutes big old proud ship like that Dunzo Absolutely done so. Sinking into the depths. To be found years later by Robert Ballard and friends. Okay. At the cost of three planes. Three. Off we go. Nicely done, gentlemen. Or to be. Got peanut butter sandwiches and ice cream for you. Waiting for you when you guys get back home. Oh, geez. All right, so here we go. Um, IJN. Carriers. Kagi. Sonk. Kaga. Sonk. So do you. Uh, heading back towards Japan. Hiryu. Sonk. Shoei and Zui, sunk sunk. Junio is still out here somewhere, so that's one. Um, Tayo, done. Unryu, one more. So that's two heavy carriers in service. And that's it. And then battleships, the only one that's left is uh, Heizen, if I'm not mistaken. Yep, that's the only one. Sagami, done. All three of the girthy girls, donezo. Nagato and Mutsu done. Um, Issei, Issei, Issei and Hyuga done. Uso, Yamashiro done. Congo, all our sisters, donezo. <laughs> all right, boys. Uh, the Pacific is ours, basically. So let's go ahead and pull these guys back and see if anything else decides to come out and fight us. They probably won't, but they might. We might chew up some planes out of Guam tomorrow. Um, but let's go ahead and pull back to see what's going on. A herring. 
Uh, still has some torpedoes. Drum has few torpedoes. Haddock has a few torpedoes, so they're still out here. Uh, the British are inbound with uh, Malaya, Perth, Van Galen, our Dutch friends, Nepal. And uh, you guys are heading back. You guys are heading back. You guys here are loaded up. Yes, correct. Oh, I thought I did that. Maybe not. It's cargo. I did not. Uh, gas. Gas. Supplies. Supplies. Oh no, we need engineering, don't we? Engineering. Engineering. Cool. Off you guys go to Saipan. Since it's just wasting its time there on wake. And we are ready. Ready, Freddy. Guam is probably next. As soon as we get uh, Test Force 49 back up there. Ready to go. And test force speed down here to actually like resupply. And you guys, I wanted to resupply you guys because we're a little bit low on wildcats. So let's get those guys in here today. Let's go ahead and resupply. Rearm. And yep, good on planes. Back out, you guys go. <clears throat> let's get you out there. Uh, you guys are in good position here. Fully loaded, ammo, damage ain't too bad. Um, yeah, I'm sorry guys, I'm feeling a little cathartic now, man. So we absolutely put a, a complete batch of dingers on Japanese here tonight. So let's go ahead and run this here another day and see what happens. Uh, but next on the list is probably going to be Guam. Uh, I'm ignoring truck. So we could take Kavyang, uh here pretty soon. We got to get a whole bunch of supplies down here, but that's what these guys are here for. We're gonna bulk these guys out with a couple more C3s. Let's go ahead and get those guys back up. See if we can actually get that uh, set up here pretty quick. And but yeah, this is looking pretty good. We should probably send up a couple search planes up this way because these are Avengers out of Enterprise. Let's go ahead and kick out a couple more out of Enterprise. Nope, not rearm. Uh, launch aircraft. Because we've been using these guys to good effect as search planes. I mean, we had a little bit of a tough time in the beginning. What are these, 567? Uh, spotting some dudes. Oh, that's way too far. Hang on. 567. Had a little bit of a tough time spotting guys up here before. But we found what we were looking for. And so we're just going to keep doing that and keep these guys. I mean, we could use Dauntlesses out of here just for a little bit more range, but let's just keep it nice and close, shall we? We got tons of dudes out of Saipan here, too. We got Libertators, we got Cats, we got Mariners. We need to start kicking out more of these Mariners here. So these guys are all out of, these are Cats. A lot of here. Let's go ahead and kick up a few of these Mariners out of here. Because we got a ton of them. Um, just do some long range recon patrol. Some lurping out of here. Way up in here. We're going to get jumped by some guys coming out of Ewo. Uh, but push come shove. We'll spin around and shoot them down. At least that's the plan. So. In fact, I can probably pull back most of the carrier planes. Now that these guys are in a really good spot here to keep eyes on the uh, North Central Pacific for us. Yeah, let's go all the way out to Okinawa here. Perfect. Here we go. So here we are, 23rd of October, 1942, and we own the Central Pacific. They can come out and fight us again. They might sneak something around us and come down here and try and bombard this again. But we got boys en route. Oh, you guys need to head back too. 
So, sorry. Not paying attention here. Same thing with you boys. Let's go back up to Wake. You're all C3s, so we can go ahead and suck all the supplies out of here. And a few more troops. So, those guys are probably bored as hell on, on Wake Island. So, we'll go hook you up with a little trip to Guam. <laughs> That's okay, man. They're nice and fighty, and they want to fight. So these are all B-17s. Let's go ahead and kick out another fort out of here. Just in case there's any submarines out here somewhere. I don't know. I don't think we're going to see too many of those. But you never know. This is pretty good coverage out here. This is pretty freaking good. Yeah, it's time to go scrape down Guam as soon as these guys get back. What do we got up here? Let's go ahead and pick up a whole bunch of boys up in here with our remaining $21 dues. And you guys here. Yeah, you guys are gonna have to go back too. Um, 21 bucks. How much do these ships cost? Ha, <laughs> no, not you guys. Uh, Archies. Twelve. Hmm. Twenty-one seven. Are these cost seven? What do you guys cost Arcturus. How many spots? I got three. What does an Arcturus actually hold? Uh, Twenty-one, or we could do uh, twelve and nine. Yeah, let's do that. So, 112, and give me a C2, there we go, done, uh, merge both these guys, there we go, oh, wait a minute, I had another one, gross, Jesus, <laughs> let me wash that down, um, yeah, okay. Let's go ahead and load this guy up. Because Midway is chock full of all the things. So, here we go. Uh, wait a minute, what do we got in Midway? 8,000 boys, 18,000 supplies. We need to get some supplies down there. Uh, same with engineering. So, here we go. Um, cargo. Let's do some boys. More boys. Uh, supplies, uh, gas, and then gas, and then engineering, and engineering. 117 on this guy? Wait, what was this guy? 88 or 880 or 1280 supplies. Let's take uh, supplies. So, here we go. <laughs> and off you guys go back down to Saipan. And then right behind you are these other dudes here. Uh, Amphib Group A. Yeah, we probably don't need another baby carrier. So let's just hang on to it. These guys have Harris's. So let's go ahead and load up. Um, boys. Gear. Boys, perfect. Gear and gear, perfect. And you guys head down towards uh, Saipan. Yeah, and that'll be our attack group towards Guam. Force B coming in. Colorado, Mississippi. We might flush this out with another destroyer here. So it'll take a couple days for them to get there. So and then. You guys heading that way, you guys heading that way. Perfect. Where's my other Amphib group? Uh, Amphib group A? Where is B? B is right there. So they're right behind them. So they're going to need some more boys too. Perfect. Off we go. Nothing. So look at this. We just absolutely scrubbing down the Philippine Sea here. With search planes. So let's go ahead and keep these guys on the move. 
here in a little bit. There's one, two more Japanese carriers out there somewhere, and they might show up. So, but probably not tonight. So let's see. We'll just give it a little bit more time here, and everybody down here is being cool. So why don't you guys set up a little patrol pattern down here? Just provide some air cover. Uh, Enterprise or York and Lex have done a lot in this war. And so their boys deserve a little bit of downtime. We'll see if we can give it to them. Let's go ahead and run this one more day. Just see what we can find. Yep, dude's coming out of Guam. Cool. Fine by me. This guy needs to be dog caught. So this is Task Force 21 Saipan. Let's go ahead and launch up all the Wildcats here. And dog catch those guys in. Task Force 21, it's a bad. Uh, where are you guys? There you are. Perfect. Give them some air cover as they come in. Go ahead and offload those guys and see exactly how much we have spooking around down here in Tinny and Saipan. Um whole day no sightings up here it'll probably be a little bit of time before we see another sighting because they're gonna have to reconstitute new task groups after we destroyed both those carrier groups uh, but probably next video so anyway here we go here we go hey do what I told you to do God. get in there there we go <laughs> <laughs> unload all how are we doing oh man look at this yeah oh man mm. yeah yummy all right so we can upgrade the port now engineering 544 let's go ahead and hit that 300 still need more gas but there is more gas on the way so um, but I want to get both these up to a five and so that's going to take a little bit of time but that's the plan so if it shows up in Midway we are going to ship it over here to Saipan uh, with the exception of the little bit that we're going to send down to uh, um, Milne down here did I, did I jack that up I totally did you guys aren't going that way you guys are going this way <laughs> are we gonna do that these boys desperately need supplies down here what's coming in no I'm not gonna use guys for that nah we need the gas over there so this is TF 49 side pan Uh, say I P A N. All right, boys. Uh, you guys down here in Rabal, you're gonna have to make do for a little bit. So we'll we'll get another convoy down your way. Uh, actually, these guys are perfect. Right here. Oh, these guys are perfect. So these guys are perfect. Uh, Rabal. There we go. So we got tons of supplies here. Yep. Hey, yay. Oh, yes, yeah, perfect. Look at all our supplies. Let's go ahead and do this. Uh, supplies. 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 And some more boys. Perfect. All right, so... Change your plans. You guys are going down towards Rabal. <laughs> so, there we go. Yay. All right. So what are we at? Buck 29. Uh, that's a pretty good place to pull the pin here tonight. So 2021. Uh, let's go ahead and run up to the morning. Just get everybody kind of like sorted out. Um, and all my search plans out. Let's, uh, yeah, you guys are good. Summer ends are good. Down here. Probably don't need this guy down here anymore. We might actually want to buy another sub or two and start. Actually, you know what? Let's do that. Let's, uh, uh, this is a three. 
So let's go ahead and pull all these guys back in. And you got 11 torpedoes? Yes. Let's go ahead and rearm all the torpedoes. Actually, you're good. So why don't you get up here and start patrolling south of Japan. Yes. And we'll get the other two guys up in there soon. Um, these two guys down here... I don't think anything else is going to come out of truck anytime soon. We might want to kick these guys way out here. Just to see what's going on out here. Yeah, let's do that. How are we doing on torpedoes? Eight? No, no, start. Stop that. Let's uh, get you guys pulled back into Milne. And rearmed. You guys deserve a little bit of shore leap too. How about you? You're at eight too. So yeah, let's do the same thing. Going around this way. Come on back into mill. Get you guys uh get you guys a little bit of shore leave and rearm with torpedoes. And then I think we'll send them out here. We might actually grab another S boat or two as well. So but anyway, here we are, 26 October 1942, 5 o'clock in the morning, day 242, no dollar dues in the command bank. But oh my gosh, like the Japanese Navy is freaking cooked. So today we actually bagged, or the last couple days, we actually bagged two heavy Japanese carriers for a total of, what is that, almost 60,000 tons. And uh, well, in a heavy cruiser. Um, yeah, they're going to have a bad time. They're going to have a bad time. So we'll see. Um, they're probably still going to send some stuff down here, try and do some... BS garbage here either with Guadalcanal or Bombard Milled. So but we, we've got them here pretty quick. So Guam is next on the menu. Iwo is right after that. Um, after that, yeah, probably Okinawa. So, But we've only got two heavy Japanese carriers left. And we get a whole bunch of command points coming our way here in the next few days. And so um, we'll stand up another task group here pretty quick. We'll let the... Uh, let our Australian and British friends take care of their friends down there at Milne. Um, they've been holding the line pretty well. And so, um, but yeah, so this war is getting a little long in the tooth. Um, kind of curious to see what they throw at us. But <laughs> regardless of that, hope to see you there next time. Uh, questions, comments, concerns? Bang, bang, bang. You guys know where those things go. It's good to see you all again. So hopefully we get another live stream up here. Oh, uh, hopefully soon, man. So it's, it's, it's been a little bit of a, a little bit of struggle the last week or two, but I still think about you guys. And so, uh, thanks for coming out and seeing me again. Uh, we'll see y'all soon. Take care now. Bye. <laughs>